Today we're going to show you about this uh, new thing that we came across over at a uh, little trip to B&H the other day. These are things called bongo ties. What the heck are bongo ties? This is a bongo tie. Here's what you use them for. If you have, let's say, some unruly cable, and you want to kind of get it a little bit cleaned up there, you can actually use it somewhere else, store it easily. So now, bongo tied. There we go. What we originally wanted to use it for was just got the brand new uh, Pocket Wizard Plus X. The idea was let's put it on a speed light. Hook it up with the uh, appropriate uh, cabling from this unit to the speed light. The nice thing about the Plus X is they come with a couple of cables. But how to attach it? So I went to B&H and said, okay, I've got this, I've got this. How am I going to put them together? They said, well, of course, bongo ties. So see how it works. And there we have it. A little bit of adjustment. Still able to use all the controls. And now, by adding in my, my cable here, and my other side of the cable onto the speed light, I have a fully handheld remote control speed light. You can add on whatever modifiers you'd like. Whether you want to go for this kind of modifier. Here is uh, one of our personal favorites these days. Now, looks a little bit unwieldy, looks a little bit rigged, but you now have a softbox that you could point anywhere, add anywhere. What you also need is on the other side of your camera, here is the uh, mini TTI, and this is what's going to trigger this Plus X. I'll tell you though, if I was buying things again, I would possibly just get two of these. See the size difference, I know. Two of these, this is a receiver transceiver. Receiver transmitter, sorry. Once again, they're called, they're called bongo ties. A bag of 10, five bucks. There's always gonna be a bag of 10 in my gear bag from now on.